What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. Today we have what appears to be a massive package. And I took a little peek in here because I wasn't sure what this was. It appears to be viewer mail. This is insane, this is crazy. Just real quick, we're gonna do the giveaway, then we're gonna get into this. We're giving away a BPT 2003 XYZ Dragon Cannon. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, and let me know what you think about this package, what your favorite pack is, etc., etc. There's a few different ones. It's going to be pretty cool. So I'm going to show you guys what's in here. Okay, he said open first. So we're going to open this first before we get into all this stuff. Open first. We have the giveaways. So there's an extra giveaway here. Then we have a note, which doesn't seem to want to open. Here we go. Hey, Ruxin, big fan of your channel. I've been watching for a very long time. My wife blames you for getting me back into the game, LOL. I'm sorry, I'm really sorry. <laughs> Besides the five D's packs, there are two more surprises. It's up to you if you want to open all of them in one video or separate. I've been saving these for a while to send to you so you could open them for me. There's also a giveaway. I sent some of my favorite cards for a lucky viewer to win. Thanks for this, and I hope you can pull great cards, Ghost Rare. Omar. So Omar sent these in. Let's see what he's gonna give you guys, and then we're gonna show you what packs he's having open. It's gonna be pretty good. All right, so for the giveaway, the bonus giveaway, we've got um, ooh, some pretty cool cards. We've got the Stardust, Le Levioneer, the Cypher Blade Dragon, Infinity, and TGEX, or TGX. Five extra cards plus the VPT, which is pretty cool. All right, so we're gonna be opening in this video. A ton of different stuff. We've got a uh, Duelist Tin, a Crimson Crisis Special Edition, okay, Unweighed Ghost Packs, Raging Tempest Special Edition, Ancient Prophecy Special Edition, okay, Stardust Overdrive Special Edition, okay. What is this? Oh, here's an opened the Duelist Genesis Special Edition. That's what it looks like. We have two sealed the Duelist Genesis Special Editions. Then we have some, oh, this looks like it came open, but uh, Metal Raiders Special Edition. The cards are starting to come out here, but that's not too big of a deal. The pack should be sealed. Dark Crisis, Invasion of Chaos. We've got LOB, that's pretty awesome. Another LOB, another LOB, Pharaoh Servant, and we have LOB and Dark Crisis. So all of that, plus we have the extra packs, whatever that is. So we're gonna go like this. So we got extra, extra, extra. Thank goodness I have this um, new setup so I can actually fit all this stuff here. All right, let's open this up. We have some extra packs, which look like, okay, that's Lightning Overdrive. Lightning Overdrive, first edition, and some Tune Chaos. Okay, that's gonna be fun. So yeah, this is gonna be a big opening. Okay, so we have a ton of stuff. Sit back, grab your popcorn. You guys know what to do on these long videos. This is going to be crazy. We're just going to start opening. I'm probably going to try and save some of the nicer 5D stuff for the end. Uh, maybe some LOB, stuff like that. And we're just going to run through it and see if we can pull something epic. So this should be pretty fun. AI meet you. Um, we've got the Gone Gold Gold or whatever. I don't know. <laughs> Lightning Overdrive. Okay, back to it. Let's see what we can get. Um, can we get the Starlight Black Rose? That would be pretty insane. with the S-Force Dog Tag. Curry Way. Laval X Lord. Okay. All right. Let's try. Um, let's try one of the Tune Chaos real quick. Let's try that. So we haven't opened Tune Chaos in quite a while. So it could be pretty epic to pull something big. Here we go. Got the Gemini Ablation. Oh, Saber Tooth. The, the Saber Tooth that used to be like a twenty dollars super rare in our favorite set, Dimension of Chaos. But or maybe it was Ultra Rare. It might have been Ultra Rare, but it was a pretty big card. Got reprinted though, it definitely hurt the value. So let's see, we got the War Rocks, those are all good. They're fantastic, they're the best. Oh, Rux and Special, classic. How many Rux and Specials in this video? Put your guesses in the comments. <laughs> We're gonna get through these like uh, the special packs or like the extra packs early, and then we'll get in all the special editions and stuff. Springin's Brothers, Agnister. Oh, an ultra rare, Riliona, the Wondrous Majestus Witch Wardrobe. That is a Mouthful of a card. I'm sure we pulled it at some point since we pulled like all the cards I think out of lightning overdrive at some point not not like the high rarities, but we pulled like the ultras and stuff Okay, back to tune chaos. Can we get a collector rare? That'd be pretty crazy the DN Sublimation night. I remember pulling that guy a lot. We opened like three cases of tune chaos. It was pretty insane That was a fun set. That was pretty fun and speaking of we're going to be opening some King's Court on Whatnot tonight, so go- Oh, A Collector Rare! It's the Chaos Daedalus! 
I think that's the worst one besides the sword, but I mean, we actually got a collector rare out of like three packs. That's nuts. Okay, it's a good start to the video, but if you compare this to like, let me get out one we pulled. This collector rare to like this one, just look how much better. Actually, it kind of looks the same right there, but you can't really see this one as well. But yeah, pretty cool. That's a good start, good start. We got the pot of desires, we were always looking for those. But as I was saying, tonight on Whatnot, we're opening some King's Court, so go check it out. My link will be in the description if you guys want to check out my Whatnot. It's pretty fun. Download the app, get right to my profile, follow me, save the show, all that stuff. Let's keep going. We've got some, a lot more epic packs. This is going to be a long, long video. Or at least, it's going to be long before I edit it. I might be editing out a lot of stuff because, uh, like, all this opening, like, special editions and stuff is going to take a very long time. So there's our extra extra cards and we have dark crisis what can we get here dark christ outstanding dog we got the non-spell casting the guardian chaos and the kelback so just a regular rare in our well common in our rare spot let's go ahead and get into these dual genesis they're already open so we might as well open them you know what i'm saying here we go all right, we've got the uh, Eradicator Epidemic Virus, which was a secret rare force of the Breaker. That's kind of how they chose these special cards. They did, like, secret rares from previous sets, so it's kind of weird. So let's go into the Duelist Genesis. We could pull a Ghost Rare Stardust. I mean, that would be the craziest thing ever, would it not? Here we go. Junk Bearish, Remote Revenge, Jute Fighter, Light Wave Tuning, Graceful Revive. Oh, there it is. Light Swarm Saber. It's after the, after the rare. I feel like... These are just so confusing. They're always either... They're never where you think they are, but that's a Light Sworn Saber. I think that's actually a pretty decent pull. Let's go into another one. We'll take a Super, but we're really looking for like a big Ghost Rare, Stardust Ultra, you know, Ulti, something like that. We've got a Genis, Psychic Rejuvenation, Junk Barrage, Beast of the Pharaoh, and Defense Draw. Oh! Ultimate Rare Stardust Dragon! Oh! <laughs> I remembered at the last second it was going to be after the rare. Oh my goodness, no way. That is a huge pull for Omar. Look at that. Look at that little ding on the back. I mean, who cares? It's still a Stardust, but wow. Wow. Okay, now we pulled the Ghost Rare. That was out of the open special edition too. Not even the sealed one. Can you believe this pull? This is my first time ever pulling an ultra or an ultimate rare. I've pulled the ultra only. That is crazy. That is so awesome. This is a great start. We've got a collector rare. And look at look, they were upside down. We've got an ultimate rare. Stardust. Not just an ultimate rare, a Stardust Dragon. That is a huge pull. Oh my goodness. We got an Oyster Meister. This is a good start. We have tons of packs left. Medium Peace Golem. Mind Over Matter. Okay, there's what it would have been. Two out of three in that special edition. That's pretty crazy. It was already open. Okay, next up, let's go into a Metal Raiders Blister Pack. This is the one that's kind of opened on the blister part. But uh, as we've seen, the ones that were opened already kind of were, uh, they're kind of hitting. They're hitting big. Okay, we've got some uh, random cards there. Not even any foils or anything. Just rares and commons. Here we go. Let's see what we can get from MRD. Can we get the Summon Skull? Here we go. Dream Clown. Blackland Fire Dragon and Shield and Sword. Shield and Sword. Swamp Battle God. All right. Nothing crazy there. Let's open up this Raging Tempest. I think this... Is this the original evenly matched set? Is that what this is? I can't remember. No, or is this... This is Zodiacs. So, are there, are there any big cards in here? I can't remember. I really can't remember. So, we're just going to go... For like a secret rare, because I think a secret rare is the highest rarity at this point. Masked Hero Blast, and <laughs> I've seen a lot of these cards from these special editions. All right. Three Raging Tempest. These are unlimited editions, so I'm guessing there's nothing too crazy in here. But it's getting to be like, I think 2017 was when it came out, so it might actually be worth something now. Bunny Blast. Spiral Tough. A secret rare. Zodiac Broad Bull. Okay. I don't think this guy's worth too much, but that's a secret rare. That's highest rarity in this set. Okay, I think he's worth a couple bucks. I think I'm right about that. That's, I mean, that's a good pull. <laughs> that's a good pull, because usually you get supers. You get one every pack, but then you, ultras are like one every 12 still. No, secrets are one every 12, and ultras are one every like four or something. So it's the, it's the hardest card to pull. That's what I don't really like about this era, though, 
is the hardest card you can pull is one every 12. So it's like, eh, not that rare. And then they got crazy and made it one every 600 with Starlights. Oh, there's a super rare. Okay, those are guaranteed in this set. Okay, Raging Tempest. So I was right. It's, there's a Zodiac and we pulled it. Okay, Arc Fiend, Gun Prize, Eater of Millions, Ancient Gear Reborn, and another super rare. This is kind of like the dead era of like collecting to me. It's like before, after they had Ghost Rares, it was like 2015 to like 2019 when they added Starlights. There was like not much to collect. It was like you're either playing and you're trying to pull those cards or like you don't get anything at all. There's like nothing worth collecting because it's all so easy to pull. Okay, it's time for an LOB pack. With the luck we've had, we might pull the blue eyes to be honest. <laughs> okay, so thanks again, Omar. I, didn't, I never said thanks for sending these in just to be open. Oh, Dark Lord con uh, Contact. Oh, Battle Fader, that's cool. Um, just for sending them in to be open. You guys can send in, if you guys have epic packs like this, like old school 5Ds and you want me to open them, send me a message. And uh, if it's something that'll make an epic video like this, then I'm definitely interested in opening them for a video. Um, Fear of Seeking. So yeah, it's it's just, a, it's fun for me. The thing is, I if it's like new sets, probably not, because I already opened so much of that. But if you can send me some really cool stuff like this to open, and even if you want it sent back, like send your pulls to you, then I can do, usually do that. Okay, we have Ancient Prophecy. I'm going to open this thing up. Okay, so we have a Solar Recharge. That's cool. That's a Light Sworn card. It's cool to see. And we have three Ancient Fairy, Ancient Prophecy, Ancient Fairy Dragons in here. That is correct. We are going to get the Ultra Rare, Ultimate Rare, and the Ghost Rare in one special edition. <gasps> Blackwing Fane, Steel Chain. There we go. Pixie Ring. Electronic Magnet Bar, and a super rare Beast King Barbaros. -er. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. All right, so we got a, a Blackwing Fane to Steel Chain, so that's good. Now, we need a second one. Advanced draw. Ooh, Earthbound Immortal Kisalu. Kusalu. I don't know. He cusses too. Okay, I don't know. Ultra rare, so we're two for two on the special edition. That's pretty good. Okay, only one Fain the Steel Chain, though, so uh, not that crazy. Third pack, let's see what we can do. Can we go three for three? These special editions have been crazy so far. Scary Moth. Infinity Beast. Imperial Custom. Sunny Pixie. Quacky Miru Speeder. Okay, we finally struck out the Axon Kicker, which is an Ultra Rare and Duel Links, but a common in the original set, which is funny. Let's get into a, another Blister. We've got the LOB. Let's pull the Blue Eyes. Here we go. We've got Ninja Cajun. Hopefully, we'll pull the uh, the rare Ghost Rare in one of these, in uh, one of the extra cards. Because I've heard of it happening besides just me, so I know it's happened twice now. We got the King Fog, Electro Whip, Frenzy Panda, He No Tamaso. No, no luck with the LOB so far. We're struggling. We are struggling. Okay, it's time for Crimson Crisis. Here we go. Look at this. They have. Oh look, the games. They show the games on these special editions. That's interesting. May 2009. We're a little late. We might be able to get there. Okay, so we got... Oh, a Necroface. That's actually like a $5, $6 card, I think. It's got a weird texture to it. Super rare. That's that's a good promo. That's not guaranteed either. I think there's a few different ones. Now we've got three Crimson Crisis packs, guys. Can we pull... What is it? Red the Arch, Red Dragon Archfiend Assault Mode. That's what we want. Ghost Rare. Ebon Arrow. Alien Overlord, okay. And we're trying to mix up. We've got two more packs of Crimson Crisis. I don't think I've ever pulled anything crazy out of Crimson Crisis, to be honest. No, I'm thinking I don't think I have. Metaphysical Regeneration, Ventral Servant, Desert Protector, Alien Ammonite. Okay, this one's definitely not too crazy so far. Let's see what this third pack can do. Come on. I mean Necroface was a good one. We've got an assault counter. We've got Trap Eater. Prevention Star. Dark Tinker. I love that guy. BS Core. Oh, Dimension Fortress Weapon. It was after. Hard to keep up with these. Summer before, summer after. Cards cannot be set from the deck to the graveyard. Sent from the deck to the graveyard. Interesting. Very kind of a random effect, but you have to be on the field. Doesn't sound like that. Next, we have this Duelist Pack Collection, which has four foil cards, three Duelist Packs, and a Duelist Revolution Pack, which is going to be pretty cool. Okay, let's open this thing up. These are the ones I found in stores like, like last year. There were some of these in stores for like 10 bucks. 
Which was crazy because the Duelist Revolution pack itself would like cover that. All right, there's the. Uh, oh, you think you'd get in? Takes to be a world champion? I don't know, maybe. 2008, there's a House of Champs winning around then. Okay. All right, cool little thing here. Then we have the packs and the promos. So that's pretty cool. So the promos have Frozen Fitzgerald. I think it's a few super rares. We're not going to open this. So I'm going to leave that sealed for him. And then we're going to open up the Duelist Revolution and three Duelist Pack You Say 3. I don't think You Say 3 has too many crazy cards. The Duelist Revolution is kind of what we're hoping for. There is Synchro Material. It's a super rare. That's not guaranteed. So that's actually pretty good. We got a strategy card. Cool. Super rare Synchro Material. Two more packs. Here we go. All right, can I get this open? There we go. Second booster, Sonic Chick. That's a classic 5Ds card. And the final Yusei 3 pack. I don't open this set very much, so it's uh, nice to see this every once in a while. Damage Eater. I think Stardust is in here as like a rare or something. Stronghold Guardian. That's a cool card. Okay, and we have the Duelist Rev. Let's see if we can get a Ghost Rare. Can we get Effect Veiler, Ultimate Rare? Can we get Solemn Warning? Can we get Pot of Awesome Secret Rare? We got the Synchro Fusion. Plant the Archer. Scrap Archfiend. This guy is always in Duelist Revolution. Is it possible to open this without pulling this guy? I don't think so. He's a generic 2700 Synchro, though. That's not that's not awful. We got the Synchro Fusionist. That guy's creepy. And Watt Pheasant. Let's open this Invasion of Chaos Blister now. We haven't opened Invasion of Chaos in this video. It's going to be pretty big, pretty epic. We've got uh, Hayate, the Earth Star, Windrose. Zombie Master, that's cool. There's some old cards in here. Gold Series, Sart, IOC Chaos Sorcerer, which goes well with the IOC pack. That's pretty cool. Maybe we'll pull another Chaos card out of here. You know what I'm saying? You know that Chaos that we're looking for? Maybe a Soldier-like sort of a BLS. Ooh, or a Dark Mirror Force. And then a nice, a Compulse. That's actually pretty good. Dark Mirror Force. We don't pull this one too often. That's pretty cool. Ultra Rare. It doesn't have too much value, but it looks insane. I mean, just backwards mirror for it. It's pretty cool. We still have two Duelist Genesis Special Edition, so we're going to go ahead and get into one. We've already pulled the Stardust Dragon. So, uh, can we get the Ghost? Anybody down? Is anyone interested in the Ghost? Yes, I am interested in pulling it. The promo is Heraklinos. Cool. We've seen that guy before when we did a break of the... Was it a whole Special Edition? I think it was. We opened a bunch of these. That was fun. We didn't pull Stardust, though, which is, you know, not as fun. But this is way more fun. Cranium. Dr. Cranium. Gotta love him. Dark the Dark Charmer. That's a good one. What is that? There's something on him, too. That's weird. Telekinetic Charging Cell. And the Domino Effect. All right. We're slowing down our Duelist Genesis. I get it. You don't want to give us the Ghost Rare. We want it. <laughs> Here we go. Overworked. Turbo Booster. Tricky Spell 4. Oyster Meister. The Tricky. Sort of Kusanagi. A lot of tricks are being played here. Third pack of the special edition. Come on. I believe in the Ghost Rare. Here we go. Krebons. Medium Piece Golem. Junk Badage. Remote Revenge. Trap of Darkness. And Nitron Synchron. Nitro Synchron. All right. Not the most exciting card. It's not as it's a soda can with a little faucet on it. Interesting. All right, let's do Dark Crisis. Let's see what we can get here. Whoa, <laughs> that one opened very easily. We got some super rares. So far, nothing too crazy in these extra cards, which is not surprising. But then we have DCR. Can we pull it? Exodia Necros or Vampire Lord. I've never pulled that either. Shadow Knight Archfiend. Checkmate. Ojama Trio. And the Lunalite, or Lunatite, I should say. Okay, Stardust Overdrive. Let's see what we can do here. Stardust Overdrive, Special Edition. All right, our promo card is the Tempest Magician. That's a cool card. Crossroads of Chaos, Secret Rear. And Stardust Overdrive Packs. Here we go. Let's pull something epic. Can we get it? Is it Majestic Star? Is that what it is, I think? Tillian Spawn, Raging Mad Plants, and the Regulus. Okay, Solitaire Magician. Two more packs. 
SOVR. We don't open this too much. I still have some of this on my website. So check out Ruxin34.com if you're interested in buying some. It can be opened on the channel or it can be opened uh, at your home. Majestic Dragon. This got a reprint. This used to be like 11 bucks for a super rare, which is insane. So I'm guessing it's gone down now after the reprint in the most recent set, literally. Um, but yeah, that was actually a pretty good pull for a while. Final SOVR. SOVR had so many high cards just for no reason. Like, like a pointer of the Red Lotus when it was like $20 common and stuff. Attack Pheromones. Ultimate Rare Explosive Magician. Check that out. Oh my goodness. What an opening. That looks insane. I don't know the value on this thing, but look at that. Wow, that looks good. Oh my goodness. All right, we have a Pharaoh Servant pack. We only have like six more packs total in this huge opening. So I hope you guys have enjoyed it. I hope your popcorn was tasty. Somebody was telling me about their popcorn in the comments the other day that they, they heated up. Two Dark Crisis, original rares. That's cool. Got a uh, Brine Gear. Okay. Let's get that Jinzo. Let's get that Buster Blader. Here we go. Attack and receive. Mr. Volcano, Minor Goblin Official, Flame Champion, Shallow Grave, Wing Reaver, and Island Turtle. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, let's go one LOB, then we'll do the Special Edition, then we'll do the last LOB to end it. Let's see if we can get Omar more epic cards. It's already been crazy, so. Oh, Ancient Rules Secret Rare, that's actually pretty good. Silver's Cry, we got some uh, Blue Eyes support, we like that. Rhyme Style loves that. Oh, look at all these traps, two Imperial Order, two Magic... Cylinder and one Mirror Force and Boralod. That's not a bad little uh, little hand right there. Hand of uh, cards we pulled. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying about hand. Okay, here we go. LOB. We have pulled nothing from LOB yet. Teat Dragon. Silver Bone Arrow. Terror the Terrible. All right, saving it for the end. Beaver Warrior and Silver Fang right next to each other. That's a good pack. Last special edition. Here we go. Let's see what we can get, guys. Make sure you guys like this video. Subscribe if you've enjoyed it because we've got more old school epic openings. And uh, we're getting close to 100K, so keep hitting that like and subscribe button. All right, our promo, another Hero Klinos, okay? And three packs. And then we have LOB. Here we go. Been a pretty crazy opening, but can we top it off with more craziness? Oh, this is getting destroyed. Dual Genesis feel different than like any other pack. It's weird. Dark the Dark Charm. We got Junk Barrage. Fish Step Charge. Small Piece Golem, Izanami, and Quillbald Hedgehog. All right, we're on a cold streak. We started two for two on the Duel's Genesis. I think we've hit maybe one. We've hit one super since. We've got the Mirror of Yata, Small Piece Golem, Turbo Booster, Light Sworn Barrier. Here we go. Made to Macabre and Psychic Snail. Psychic Snail, okay. All right, final the Duelist Genesis. It's been good to us. We pulled... The ultimate rare Stardust, which was insane. Can we pull the Ghost Rare right here, right now? Here we go. Psy Impulse. We got the Destructotron. Dr. Cranium. Mirror of Yada. Grapple Blocker. Here we go. Come on. Kanoichi. Okay, saving it for LOB. I see how it is. Saving it for LOB. And the final pack of this long video. I don't. It's at 33 minutes uncut, so, I mean, there's been a lot of package opening. I assume it's going to be, like, in the low 20s at this point. Could be wrong, though. It's definitely still pretty long. So we've got the uh, Spell Power Grass, the Curry Bandit, Man Eater Bug, that's cool, all of Insect Queen. Where is what, Parasite? Where's the Petit Pequeno Moth? What was the Italian name again? Oh, I can't remember. Oh, you guys haven't seen that video yet. Spoilers, you'll see it soon. I think tomorrow, maybe. All right, here we go. Green Phantom King, Larvis, Machine Conversion Factory. Polymerization! What a way to end it. That's pretty good. Our only foil out of the LOB packs, but it's a good one. We will take that super rare polymerization. One of the best in the set, so it's pretty awesome. All right, so our foils besides the promos, we have a Lightsworn Saber, the Beast King, Dimension Fortress. Necroface was a promo, but it's a really good one, so I pulled it out. Synchro Material, Scrap Archfiend, Nitro Synchron, Majestic Dragon used to be like $10, $11. Polymerization is a great one. Then for our Ultras, we got the Relona. Dark Mirror Force is one of our um, old school ultra pulls. Then we got the Earthbound Immortal. That's cool. A Secret Rare Zodiac Broadbull. Not many Secret Rares in this opening because a lot of them couldn't even have Secret Rares, but 
Chaos Daedalus was, I mean, we got a collector rare. It was, it's a pretty bad one, but it's still a collector rare from Toon Chaos, which is really cool. Then we got an ultimate rare explosive magician and Stardust Dragon ultimate rare. This is insane. First time I've pulled it. I'm so hyped about it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was insane. It was pretty long. There's a lot of epic packs. We had some great pulls. If you did, make sure to like the video, subscribe. Also, check out my whatnot in the link in the description. We're doing King's Court auctions there so you guys can get some packs. Hopefully, we'll pull another God card and some epic collector rares. And that's it for this video. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Shining Abyss. Ooh, the Revival Jam. Oh, and oh!